Well, the Guam Waterworks Authority has broken ground on an $18 million project to build three new 1 million plus gallon water tanks at Jigo and Astumbo. GWA will begin construction on two 2 million gallon water tanks in Jigo and one 1 million gallon tank in Astumbo. The projects will be funded with GWA bond money and will cost nearly 18 and a half million for all three tanks. The project is part of a larger court order required by the US EPA to bring GWA into environmental compliance. GWA won't be won't just be replacing three tanks, however. According to CCU Chairman Joey Duenas, the project will also include replacing the tank's piping system, new valves, and better controls. But how will the new tanks benefit the GIGO community? Yes, there are a lot of technology stuff that we're putting in, and, and it's going to help us better control the system. For example, if you have a really big water break in, a, say, an 8-inch line or a 12-inch line, um, you want to be able to control these tanks so that you don't let the tanks drain empty. Yeah. Because there's a break before we can get to the break, before we even know if there's a break. Sometimes we find out of the break, but it's been happening already. Then the tanks will be empty. So what these do, hopefully someday we'll be able to control the valves and say, okay, shut the valves, keep the water in the tank while they repair the pipe so that when the pipes repaired the water restoration can be quicker and although the new tanks don't address the lingering issues in the dead and Jigo communities such as water pressure problems Duane says GWA plans on addressing those issues in five years those will be coming in the next five to ten years. That's an honest answer. Uh, you know, I'd love to say we can address it all today, but right now, GWA is addressing so many things. We have, um, by the time we're done, we'll have spent about six hundred million dollars on projects altogether. So getting to spend the whole six hundred million is not something you can do in one year. I mean, even the military buildup recognized that. And the project will be managed by the GHD with Pernix doing the construction of the tanks.